Okay, back at some voyeurism. We're gonna voyeur some stuff up. Oh, we're going to that tower right there. See it? Do you see it? Do you see it? It's brightly marked with my marker. And there's a scythe flying around nearby. You see that on the top left? But he don't see me. Not yet. Oh, now he does. It's too late, though. Because I'm already here. And... Come on, a little more. Boom. And I'm out. Ha ha. Oh, I wanted the top. Oh, I wanted the top. Oh, God. Holy crap. Jesus. I'm right on the edge. I hit I hit the edge, bounced, and slid out to here. Holy crap. I'm surprised I, I'm surprised I didn't fall off. I'm surprised, anyways. Um... Okay, so, here we are. Where's the fighting? What's going on here? Got a mag rider rolling out. Uh, yeah, his name is interesting. Um, let's see here. Zoom in on myself. Alright, yeah, yeah, this place was getting taken over, so that's why I went here, because this is going to be next. Also, this side is going to be coming up, and this is going to be a major battleground. It usually is. The thing about it being a major, major battleground is this air pad right here is going to become a uh, platform for maxes and engineers, you know, to fire anti-air stuffs. So I don't want to be up there. I think down here is probably good, although this is a platform for like snipers and other sneaky McBeakies who want to be sneaky beaky. But that's why I'm here. Uh oh. Uh, I heard <laughs> I heard somebody. I think he's up there somewhere, or maybe he's that guy. I'm not sure. Hostile engineers, huh? Ah, there he is. No, that's not an engineer. He's a he's a light assault. He's flying around. Uh, oh, Jesus. Whoa. Ah, Jesus. Okay. Well, now I'm here. Um, alright. Wait, is there... There's a guy standing there. People like to go AFK, like, right next to the Sunderer. Because they'll, like, spawn in and then just pick their nose. But the only problem with trying to you know, kill people that are standing there is like this guy spawned in. Well, he's the AFK too. And a lot of times they wake up. So, you know, I, like, like I said in the first episode, we're trying not to kill too many people if possible. I mean, I will kill somebody. <laughs> I'll shank a dude. Um, but no. I mean, I could. I got a shank. Not that you can see it, but I switched to my knife. Uh, this is not the greatest place to, to watch from. I'm gonna try to get over to the other side. Watch for mines here. Sometimes they protect themselves with mines. And we'll just get up here. Here we go. There we go. Now we can see whatever this guy's shooting at. Oh, Jesus. I just took a shot. I think it was explosion damage. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna take a, a, a tank round if I sit here too long, because they're gonna start shooting at this, and the splash damage might hurt me. I mean, it already did. Something did. I don't know. I'm at my, uh, half of my shield. We got a lot of dudes running around. I'm gonna try to get, like, right over here. While I'm here, though, I have to watch out for light assaults and stuff jumping up on the railing. Everywhere you go on this tower, you gotta watch out for people. There are multiple towers like this. You know, this is like a cookie cutter tower. Man, look at all these babes. I'm just gonna switch to my knife. That way I have a little less blur on my screen, you know? 
why not? Although then I can't zoom in. Balls to that. At least a little zoom, you know? You will see something. There's a lot of guys up there on up, up, up there on that hill. Was was this a TR? No, this is a Vanu Tower. Ah, uh, there's a TR Sunderer trying to push up. He's taking a lot of stuff. Oh, and he deploys. He's going to go ahead and make himself a spawn target and explode. Yeah, not not very smart. I mean, I think you get a shield for when you deploy. Like, the you can get a deployment shield. You know, that is one of the things that you can pick. And so he probably had that, and he figured, well, if I do, if I deploy, then I'll survive. Well, it doesn't work that way, buddy. Not when everything's hitting you. Although maybe he accomplished his mission. Maybe his mission was just to spawn or er, deploy long enough to spawn some guys. Holy God! And I just took another hit. So I would like to be able to regenerate my shields. This area is getting heavy, man. Look at all the tanks. Oh, now they got some. They got a couple more Sundays. I just seen them rolling up behind them trees. That looks like a lightning, I think. Not much of it to look at, but I think it's a lightning. Man, look at that guy. He's all sleek. Look at that. Oh, boom. He's smoking crazy. Oh, that's the guy with the, the uh, interesting name. Yeah, yeah. Space Walrus. Oh, God. I heard a cloak. Probably just somebody sniping, but uh, I think I'm gonna. Ooh, somebody hop. <laughs> somebody hopped in the turret. I see your legs. <laughs> Invisibility. Yeah, two invisible guys. So that watching these guys, you can get a little bit of an idea of what I look like. Except for I'm not purple, but you know. Was he going AFK or what? Or maybe he's sending a message. What is his name? I can't see his name. And I don't want to decloak and shoot him because there's too many enemies. Anyways, I was hoping he was going to cloak somewhere so we could actually see, you know, what he looks like. But you've seen it, for the most part. You didn't see him crouched. Uh, cloaking, which is what I'm doing all the time. You know, but he was standing and cloaked, so that's that's close enough. That's pretty close. But as you see, as you can see, when I stand up, my weapon does become more defined. I, well, as you maybe not be able to see because it's a YouTube. I forget about that part too. That is an issue. That is. That is okay. Um. Looks like they're pushing good though. Yeah, you see, you can barely even see him. Or I can barely see him. On YouTube, it gets a little blurrier. Super sneaky. I still want to kill him, like, bad. God, I feel like it could. Got him. Dropping off. Dang, that hurt a lot. Ha! <laughs> that other guy that dropped down, I feel like he was going to investigate. So I didn't want to sit. I think I can sit here for a second, though. I might even be able to decloak right here. Maybe. I mean, nobody's really looking here. Not even him. Okay, I got a little shield. Got a little shield. I should charge my implant so I can use my regeneration. Get my health back as well. 
try to go back here a little bit more. Oh, I can go in this building. I mean, you can go in every building, so I should have just figured that. Alright, if you guys want to just hold on a second, I gotta click here, load, click here, load, and then click here a couple of times. Booyah. That'll give me a couple of minutes of energy. Well, that's actually draining quite quick with this uh, level 4 implant. I'm gonna give a couple more charges. I've got a level 4 uh, regeneration, and I haven't had it very long, so... <laughs> look, in the, look in the chat, somebody says, Who threw a mag rider on my head? Yeah, um, I don't know, it was me, I guess. Could have been. I mean, I've been known to toss mag riders. Somebody is laying on the horn. Meep, 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 meep. Alright, the battle's moving. I think the, the Banu... Oh, hi! I think the Banu... Dang it, I wasn't focusing, because I was just about to bring up my map. Dude drops down behind me. He must have saw me uh, move forward slightly. Well, that's a ball sack. Anyways. Not too bad. I, I killed a guy. We'll call that an episode. We'll call that enough. Yeah. It's, it's kind of hard to make a longer episode of this, because it's hard to stay alive. I'm not very good at this <laughs> you know, sneaking around business. I'm better at playing my NG, driving a harasser. But, you know, anyway, let me know what you think about all this, and we'll see you guys next time.